Hey kiddos, now it's time for our second lesson, and that's when Adam and Eve got thrown out of the garden. So this comes from Genesis chapter 2, verse 8, and goes through Genesis chapter 3, verse 24. And here's the story. God put wonderful plants in the Garden of Eden that grew sweet berries and other delicious fruit for Adam and Eve to eat. Four rivers supplied water for them to drink. Adam and Eve had everything they needed in the Garden of Eden. God gave them important work to do. Their job was to care for the garden and rule over the animals that lived there. God gave Adam and Eve one simple rule to obey. He said, you can eat fruit from any of the trees in the garden. They, they are all here for you to enjoy, but you must not eat fruit from the tree in the center of the garden. If you eat from the tree of knowledge of good and evil, you will die. Now the serpent was the sneakiest of all the creatures that God had made. One day he crept up to Eve and asked, Did God really say that you can't eat any of the fruit in the garden? Of course not, Eve replied. We can eat whatever we want except for the fruit of the tree in the center of the garden. If we eat that fruit, we will die. Oh, come on, the serpent said. You won't really die. If you eat that fruit, you will be, just become more like God. You will actually know the difference between good and evil. The serpent kept tempting Eve to try the fruit, and it looked so juicy and delicious that finally she grabbed a piece and took a bite. It was just as tasty as it looked, so Eve gave some to Adam, and he ate some of it too. Right at the moment they ate the fruit, both Adam and Eve knew that they were naked, so they quickly tied some leaves together to make clothes. Later that night, God came to meet the man and the woman in the garden. But Adam and Eve were ashamed because they had disobeyed God, so they hid from him. When God asked Adam why he was hiding, Adam said, I was afraid because I am naked. Who told you that you were naked, God asked. Did you eat the fruit I commanded you not to eat? I did, but Eve is the one who gave it to me, Adam answered. Yes, but the serpent tricked me into eating it, Eve said. God was very sad that they had disobeyed him, but he had to punish Adam and Eve. So God made Adam and Eve leave the beautiful Garden of Eden. He even stationed a flaming sword at the opening of the garden so Adam and Eve could never go back inside. That's it. Uh, coming soon will be our third part, which is about their sons, Cain and Abel. I'll see you.